What is up everyone? It's Super here and welcome back to another Injustice 2 video and today we're actually going to be doing the final I think the final. I think this will probably cap off the mother box opening videos. Uh, I did too early on because we we're trying to get all the epic gear and stuff. And I want to do one more because there's still a lot of epic gear that I don't have. For example, I really want some Captain Cold headpieces that look really cool. There's a lot of different ones that actually look pretty awesome, including one that covers his entire face with like a black mask. Uh, there's also a, a lot of other pieces like Joker pieces and stuff like that that I don't have. So I just want to do one final Mother Box opening video and see if we could get anything that's really cool. Uh, I'm not gonna do any more gear showcase videos, unfortunately. Those take way too long, guys. Like, my voice literally hurts for the next couple of days because I have to talk for like an hour and a half straight or whatever it was. Dude, the last one was almost two hours long. And of course, I have to talk throughout the entire thing. If not, it's not entertaining, you know? So those, I can't do anymore. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll make a video showcasing like my top five new gear or like gear classes, something like that. Uh, but as far as like full gear showcase, it's not gonna happen. But I'm I really want. Okay, this is this is what I want for this one. I really don't care if I get too much epic gear, even though I am, or like new epic gear because I have a bunch of platinum and diamond mother boxes that I've just been saving for this video. Uh, all I've been doing is trying to get the legendary gear for the ninja turtles and one thing i didn't know is that i wasn't going to be able to do the uh, multiverse world little exploits that is on xbox one and for you guys who are watching this video guys don't know what what i'm going to be talking about or what i'm talking about because i'm going to explain how you do it on xbox one so the reason I was able to get so much legendary gear is because I had access through Xbox One. Now, I'm sure there's a way on PS4 because there's no way that people are getting the 250 pieces of epic and rare gear that fast. Like, there's no way. So, but I don't know the exploit on, on PS4, but on Xbox One, what you would do is you would go offline, right? So, just show you guys real quick. This is a little tutorial here. The, the point is, I can't do it with the DLC characters because the DLC characters are actually not in the rotation, which is unfortunate. Like, the only thing that they have is the sidekick events. So you go to network right here, you go offline, and then you go to system, language, and location. Then you restart your console, or you choose hard restart it. And then uh, you're able to go into any multiverse worlds you could change the time change the date to any multiverse world so what would happen is let me go back let me just show you guys real quick so you guys who are getting legendary gear for characters like the flash or batman something like that and you're on xbox one you'll be able to do this just normally because all these characters are in the rotation um so what would happen is you would go into for example this right here okay and then you would play versus the boss, or you would have the AI fight the boss, right? All you got to do is sacrifice 5,000 credits. And then look what you get as a reward. You get two pieces of epic gear every time. And with the offline technique, you could actually go to, uh, let's just say, skip a month and then go back a month. And everything would just reset. So what would happen, boom, you do, you know, you, you go a fo forward in a month and then you come back. Go to the multiverse, boom, everything is reset. And then you do it again. Boom, you have your AI do it again. That's four pieces of epic gear in like, I don't know, five minutes, whatever it takes. Then you do it again, boom, six pieces of epic gear, and then eight pieces until you reach the 250. But unfortunately, for the DLC characters, we can't do that because their main like multiverse worlds where you could just automatically fight the boss, it doesn't exist. All that exists for them is the sidekick events like this for example hellboy um so you do get pieces of epic gear but as you guys see it's just one here and you have to go through eight characters it's only one here and you have to go through five and then when you get to the boss you've already spent a, a ton of time but at least it's better than like 
I don't know, having to manually get all 250 pieces of epic gear in. Thank thankfully, I'm very close with Leonardo, which is the character I decided to go with first. But the bad thing is that you have to sacrifice 250 pieces of epic gear for every Ninja Turtle. So that's going to be a pain in the ass. I'm just going to gradually get those as time goes on. But right now I'm already starting to work on Sub-Zero and then I'm going to go to Raiden or Hellboy, something like that. The only characters that don't have those sidekick events is Enchantress and the Ninja Turtles. So unfortunately I can't even do that technique. But let's go back to this. So the, the whole point is that's what I've been doing this whole time is just trying my balls off to get... Um, you know the legendary pieces of gear for these characters man that's all i've been doing guys of course playing dragon ball but i've actually taken a lot of time off dragon ball to do the ninja turtle stuff and at least i'm getting the legendary piece of epic gear or the legendary piece of gear for um for leonardo that's gonna be coming soon i only need maybe around 40 pieces of rare or epic gear to sacrifice and I would do Enchantress second, but she doesn't have one of those sidekick events, so I can't really uh, do it for her. I just gotta wait until I have enough pieces of gear to sacrifice. So Leonardo's coming soon. Like, I have everything done with the Ninja Turtles, excluding the epic gear pieces. So this is good, like getting rare and epic abilities or pieces for TMNT, that's good because then I can sacrifice all that. Alright, so... Now let's focus here. Captain Cold, that's good. We're already getting some Captain Cold stuff. This is definitely new because a lot of the new pieces have these like light accessories on the side and the front, stuff like that. But I really want a new head. Um, I, I think I have yet to have gotten a new piece of headgear for Captain Cold. And he's still, to this day, one of my favorite characters to play. Uh, maybe top three. I'm not sure because uh, you know I have a lot of fun with Enchantress. I have a lot of fun. Joker will always be number one. Like there's just something about his playstyle that I really love. I think it's just the corner trap setups. You know, the chattering teeth are like kind of like remind me of Hunter Predator's like corner trap setups. They're just so much fun to do, and the fact that you can loop them into themselves over and over again if your opponent can block it, which is very very hard to block. Um, it's just a really attractive playstyle for me. Can you give me the goggles? Can you give me the goggles? Oh, we got the goggles, baby! Yeah! Dude, I have been wanting this piece for so long. I think Black Canary really rose in level of fun for me. I think she's a lot of fun because she is mixed city. Uh, her, Flash, Joker in the corner. There's a lot of characters that are mix, mix, mix. Th this chick is mix city, and I got the cool shades. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. All right, that's a good start, baby. So Raiden is actually going to be. Uh, I kind of want to play Raiden, as far as like his legendary ability. Uh, I think these are new. Yeah, the, I, don't, I definitely don't have these um, because I want my. Uh, S Superman, uh, Superman charge to his electric fly. That, I think that's the proper word for it. I want to turn into a fucking dragon when I do my electric fly. That's something that needs to happen. And for Black Lightning, I need to turn into a goddamn fist. Those things need to happen. And in order for that to happen, I need to get my legendary gear for Raiden. Uh, but next up is going to be Sub-Zero. Just because, ooh, damn, this is hot. These are some hot shoulders, man. She will definitely look like the highest tier of warriors with this, man. Those look really good. But yeah, um, next up after Leonardo, of course, I'm going to keep working on TMNT as time goes on. You know, Michelangelo's next, and then I'm going to go Raphael, and then Donatello at the end. Um, but I'll continuously trade in the gear whenever I can for those characters. Yes, nice. As long as we get some rare pieces and stuff. For the epic pieces for TMNT, I have a lot of them. So I'll probably trade most of it in. Ooh, look at this piece. And I got a skateboard on my back. We got to rock this with fucking uh, Michelangelo, man. I love the lights in the middle. 
Uh, let's see. Flash. I think for Flash, uh, these might be some new ones, but I'm pretty sure that I have everything that I can get. Oh, there's actually some wings for the Flash that I haven't gotten yet. Um, someone on Twitter. Ooh, damn, I don't have this. This I definitely don't have. Looks like a, a beetle of some sort right there as the emblem in the middle. That's actually nice. Yep, definitely don't have that. Um, but someone tweeted me a picture of some really cool flash wings that I for sure don't have. Um, the one thing that I got recently is I got the hats for Joker, but it's not the hat part of the um, part of the Epic Gear set. It's just the regular hat. Um, I'm pretty sure these are the ones that I have, right? These are the ones that I have already. And they look mighty, mighty fine. Mm. I don't even notice. Man, I don't know. There's a lot of characters that have, like, pretty bad accessories, right? But can we all agree that Firestorm has the absolute worst accessory in the game? Like, you can't. You could barely like and i mean barely tell the difference between any of his firestorm matrix accessory that that's how bad it is it makes me go it makes me go crazy oh they could have had his flame or something change i don't need i don't even know i don't know guys i think we could agree that firestorm has the worst accessory in the game it's just horrible horrible Oh man, these arms are cool. I love when uh, when Gear has you know the extra lights as accessories and stuff. Love it. All right, some new Catwoman stuff. Um, there's one thing that I haven't gotten. I haven't gotten new goggles for Catwoman, um, but this is definitely something new that I didn't have before. I'm happy I'm getting a lot of new stuff, even though I've been you know grinding the multiverse events or my ai has been grinding the multiverse events and the uh and the endless battles in order to rank up so obviously i've been getting a lot of different pieces of gear after matches and i've been getting a lot of mother boxes Ooh, wait did i have this already i don't remember having the hand wraps like this this looks really nice raiden as long as we cover those uh, those packs, man. I don't I don't want to get jealous of you, Raiden. Okay, you got some mighty fine packs. You've been working out. I know it. You're preparing for MK11 with a really hard chest workout regimen. But I'm I'm kind of jealous of the packs, man. I'm not gonna lie. I think those packs are on point. You can see the veins. You can see striations. You can see the definition. I don't want to see it, man. I know the ladies do, but I don't. So we got to cover that up. We got to go classic raid, which I have no problem with. Fist of the Demon Slayer. All right, definitely have to speed this up a little bit. And some of these characters that I don't really care about. The gear on, I'm not gonna lie, the gear on uh, Swamp Thing is kind of like forgettable as well. It's kind of forgettable. Swamp Thing is a really fun character, but the gear is kind of forgettable. <clears throat> Damn, those are some shin guards. I could have used those when I played soccer. Catwoman legs. Oh, wow. These are actually... There's a lot of, um, like, padding. She got the knee pads there. She got the, uh, the thing on her thigh. Definitely didn't have that before. Ooh, Adam's another character that I want to get his uh, legendary gear. I think, I, I don't know, don't quote me on this, but I want to get, like, I don't know if I will, but I want to get all the different, oh, wow. I have this, I have this one, but it's not the epic gear set related, but I do have this mask already, but I appreciate that I got the epic gear set version, and I'm sure there's a, a minor differences in this compared to the one that I already have. I'm actually rocking with it as my AI is, uh, you know, doing the sidekick events for 
for Sub-Zero. Sub-Zero's clone becomes a polar bear. I do like that mask. It looks nice. Some legs for Black Canary. All right, that that is uh those are some legs that I would rock with. Yeah. Definitely. Death Storm. Oh, this is actually part of the epic gear set that I already have. All right, TMNT, let me see what you got. Ah. Pretty pretty basic there. I don't know what what's that in the middle. It's just like a strap, I guess. To hold that big ass I don't know what that is. What is what is that thing? It just holds your weapons. It has like a fan right there. It might be like a satellite or a computer or something like that. On your back. I'm sure that's for Donatello, right? Wild West Raps. The Wild Wild West. Uh, Wild Wild West. Will Smith's best movie. He has a cowboy style star as his belt buckle. Oh, these are definitely new. I, I did not have these before. At least I don't remember. Look, you got the boots there with the metal plate. Looking looking good, Joker. Looking good. I like the style. That'll go that'll definitely go nicely with my new hat that I just got for him. Man, I wish I would have given him something more. Um, but I'll take the hat. At least I got the hat recently. Need to make a video on that. I like the cold gun, but as you guys have been seeing, man, I'm having a lot of bad luck. Uh, I think I, re I definitely already had that. I'm having a lot of bad luck with um, headpieces for Captain Cold. I just can't get them. I don't know what it is. Maybe they're really rare because he has a ton. He has one where it's like a giant square head. He has another one where... Um, Oh, here we go. Talking about it. Did I luck myself in, from talking about it? No, 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 no. Uh, no. This is a Cyclops looking helmet that I'm sure I already had. Man, he has a lot of really cool ones. Why'd they have to give me one that I already had? Cyclops looking fucking helmet. Um, but there's. Ooh, this is definitely something new. And this is part of an epic gear set. I think this matches with the badass shoulders that I got earlier today or earlier like in the video wow Wonder Woman looking this, that actually looks really nice I wonder how it looks with the different colors um, yeah but a lot of the uh, a lot of the pieces for Captain Cold that I've been getting have been just the cold guns and the arms that's it I have not gotten the badass looking head pieces that Captain Cold got I want that one where it's just like a black mask, and that's it. Flash. Flash of lightning. Fast hands. Look of sweltering heat. For Starfire, I can't really tell what's new, to be honest. Like, her head, headpiece, they didn't really, like, do anything crazy with, like they did with her... Uh, torso and arms and her um, and her legs as well. They gave her like really 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 cool um, Like a really cool new costume, but they did, they should have done something else with their hair like have it be styled in a different way You know what I mean? Like just something 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 a little bit different. No, they they kept it the same <clears throat> Blue beetle head is this something new? Oh, what? in the actual f fuck is this uh i swear to you that i have never never seen this headpiece since the legendary edition came out i have never ever seen this piece before oh my god that looks so fucking cool Wow. All right. So Blue Beetle and the Beta was pretty fun. He has some flight combos. All right. It's kind of cool. I don't like his head when he doesn't have like a cool looking mask on. 
His alternate color with the gold beetle looks really fucking cool. But I haven't had a headpiece that I really want to use. But oh my god, this is beyond ridiculous. In the best way possible. This might be one of the best headpieces I've seen in the game. And I didn't even know it existed. Wow. You guys might think I'm overreacting, but I seriously think this looks amazing like there aren't too many things in Injustice 2 that I don't know about because I gotta be on this on this stuff I have not seen this ever no one has told me hey look this is a really cool headpiece for Blue Beetle I have not seen anyone use it I haven't seen anyone with it online I didn't know this thing existed it looks so fucking cool man wow that is amazing Right now, I have a, a, a character in a movie in my head right now. I can't remember what fucking movie it is. Oh, that's right. This reminds me of the uh, the scientist in House of a Thousand Corpse. Dr. Satan. Wait. Dr. Satan. Yeah, I think Dr. Satan, right? He's underground. He looks old. But just remove like the antennas and his face looks exactly like this. Except not, not the yellow eyes either. But that's what this reminds me of the Dr. Satan from House of a Thousand Corps. Which I don't know if you guys like that movie or not, but I love it. Uh, I really love that movie. Damn. I'm just like marveling at this. Look at the detail on it. This looks like a horror movie character come to life in Injustice 2. Wow, that looks really fucking cool. That is the highlight of the video. No matter what happens, that's the highlight of the video, guys. I had no idea this thing was even a thing. Wow, that's crazy. Whew. Definitely gonna make a at least one video with Blue Beetle just for that. I Man, I don't like playing Blue Beetle that much, to be honest, but I will I will definitely make a video with that. That looks really fucking cool. Alright. Got the arms. Eh, Robin arms. They didn't really give Robin too much, uh, like, crazy looking stuff. Did they give, is this new? I don't know, man. It kind of, it kind of looks new. No, 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 no. Hold on. Mask of Perfect. I remember that name from day one, baby. That's definitely not new. Um, but did they give, like, Deadshot new, like, a new helmet or anything? I don't recall seeing anything, but seeing as I just, like... I just opened up a mother box and I got a blue beetle head that I didn't even know existed and the legendary edition came out at the end of February. Wait, February or March? I think, yeah, February. <laughs> um, I, I did, wait, February, January? I don't, whatever. It, it came out a while ago. Uh, anything is possible. So maybe there's something hidden in there. You just haven't gotten it. Uh, did I have this already? Not sure. I got a lot of uh, Superman pieces recently, which I'm very happy about. I got a new Superman head that looks like uh, he has he's wearing like a Magneto helmet. Looks pretty awesome. Shimmering Black Ice Mask. Yeah, I remember this name. I remember when I was trying to get the uh, UMK3 and MK2 Sub-Zero mask. I would always get excited when I saw one of the Sub-Zero heads. And then, oh, I have that one. I remember that name, too. And then, because I, I didn't know the names of the heads. And I was getting that one so often that I just memorized it. I'm like, yep, I got that. Seduction of Bleeze. Sounds like a weird name of a costume piece for fucking uh, Atrocitus. I guess he's trying to seduce people to come into the Red Lantern Corps. Come out with the hates. That looks really cool, but I already had it. I already had it. Some new handguns. Like the uh, different color on the tip right there. I've been shooting so much that the tip of the gun turned into a different color. What am I looking at? Fucking cyborg stuff. I, I care not for cyborg. I don't care about any piece for cyborg. Gauntlets of Mayhem. Yeah, I've had that. 
Had that one already. Source infused. Sounds familiar. Yeah. Smoke, smoke screen disguise of deception. Oh, wow. This is definitely a new, uh, new mask for Catwoman that I did not have before. I mean, I don't really like playing Catwoman too much. But doesn't mean that I don't want to have really awesome looking Catwoman gear. Moving on. Ooh, Deviant Coat of Obsession. Hmm. This this is definitely a new one. Uh, the short coat is actually new for Joker. Um, it's a lot tighter than than your normal one that you had before. I actually have another one that it looks even tighter, but is higher. It's like higher level than my current Joker at the moment, so I can't use it. I think it looks better than this one. Empowered Pioneer style. Oh, awesome. We got some more shade action going. Yeah. Look directly into the sun with these. And we got a little accessory around the eyes. Beautiful. Beautiful black canary. The Link Quay. Arms of the Winter Wild. Okay, I think I had those already. Pretty sure I used it in uh, trying to create some MK character. Why are we looking at Green Arrow's legs? Nah, nah, let's just move on. <laughs> the leg pieces are really like, why? Why even look at the leg pieces? You know what I mean? Hmm. Pretty sure I already had that. There's a lot of gear for. Uh, for Starfire that I already had. All right, I guess Cyborg. We'll look at your. We'll look at the head. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Oh wow. Okay. You know what? It's actually different. His eyes are a little bit different. Okay. This is as good as Cyborg's gonna get. To be honest, <laughs> this is like as different as he he's gonna get. They they can't really go crazy with this character as far as gear. That's why I'm like, ah, let's just skip over him. Ah, this is the star of the show right here, man. Give me some more Blue Beetle gear. These look cool, but I think I already had them. These are definitely new, but I think I already had that. No, let's just forget about the legs. New Triton here. Hmm. Already had it, but it's new. Ah, come on. Stop giving me boots and arms and fucking accessory cold guns for Captain Cold. I want a headpiece. Please. Please give me a headpiece. <clears throat> Can I get the Catwoman with uh, with goggles, please? Can I get that? Bleeding ear visor. I could have sworn that one was going to have... Some more shade action. Shock therapy. <sighs> Had that already. That came in the lunatic gear sets. Oh god, this is the worst piece of all time. <laughs> I finally got it. Oh man, see, things like this get discovered all the time, right? Like they, well, not all the time, because I've opened up a ton of other boxes. The first time that I'm getting this, but this was tweeted at me like a couple days into people trying to get some new gear. So I knew this was a thing, and I'm like, man, this looks like that one guy in Hannibal that Dr. Hannibal Lecter makes him cut his face off and slice his face with a broken piece of glass. That is what this piece of headgear reminds me of or in the tv show i think he has he has himself uh cut his own face off with a piece of glass but he feeds it to some pigs or some dogs or something like that right um but i, I remember it i've never seen the show hannibal my brother has he said it's really good but from the movie i remember dr hannibal lecter makes the guy uh he actually i think he 
throws like some sort of drug on his face or he drugs him in some way and then he makes him cut his face off and he ends up looking like this like this this mask right here that is what this mask reminds me of For, first time i saw it exactly what it reminds me of don't lie to me i know you guys you guys can't unsee it now so thank me later expert belt yeah looks pretty generic all right so last 10 oh last 15 diamond mother boxes this contains all epic gear i believe no it doesn't uh i had i'm sorry i'm a i'm a rookie at this game you don't have i haven't been playing it for like a year straight so i i should have known that you you're guaranteed at least three or two yeah it's been a long time <laughs> i think you're guaranteed two with the diamond ones for platinum you're guaranteed one <clears throat> oh whoa, 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 whoa. wait a minute let me see that club bring me that club is that a fucking fist oh that's so cool that is so cool whoever designed this piece of accessory for for swamp thing deserves uh deserves praise it's a fucking fist shaped piece of like wood covered in like moss and stuff wow that's amazing like just compare compare this accessory right to fucking the matrix accessory for for firestorm like just the difference in quality and creativity man poor old firestorm <clears throat> brutish monster head had that one the perfect the perfect fits okay great job close shaver had it already do we have can we get like the epic version i mean the ah damn it i was about to say can we get like the uh epic gear set version of the capeless supergirl i don't even know if there's an epic set version but i already have it so I, i'm being greedy at this point i already have the uh the capeless supergirl return of the dark knights yeah this this was a thing for a long time bane head looks familiar whoops accidentally pressed b instead of x could i get the arms please i don't think i have the arms yet the cool arms that she has ah damn it i still have not gotten the awesome looking new arms for uh for starfire unfortunately Right, we got eight more to go here. Captain Cold inventory is full, and I still don't have one of the new headpieces. Man, so unfortunate. But I do have the awesome blue beetle piece. Wait, is this part of the new gear? I could swear that her hair looks different. I don't know if it's because her face is like uh, darkened out, like shaded out. But it seems like your hair is a tad bit different. Maybe this is part of a new gear. Like part of the new epic gear. I I don't think so though because the name sounds really familiar. It sounds very, 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 very familiar. Some of her new arms, which I already have. There's a lot of pieces of epic gear for characters like Soups, Batman, uh supergirl that i have a ton of like new stuff for yeah these are the long giant leggings right yeah i remember those amazon battle bands whenever i get something new for the turtles i'm like yes something to trade in oh i might keep this one though I might keep this one. Got a lot of different uh, pieces to it. You got the uh, the bandana covering the the face. You got the goggles, and you got a little uh, 
I don't know what the hell that thing is. But he has a necklace. That's one that I'll keep. <sighs> Part of Epic Gear Set that I already had. Bleached gris Grizzly Coat. <gasps> this is new. Yes. This is something that is brand new that comes in the Epic Gear set, but of course it comes by itself as well, where he has the vest inside of the coats. Look at it. Look at it. With the orange and the green. It looks awesome. Hell yeah. All right. We got some work with with the Joker now. Awesome. We got a little bit more Joker here. I didn't have that chest piece before, so I'm happy that I got that. That looks pretty cool. I actually like the way that emblem looks. I don't know if I had it or not, but I don't want... Why are we looking at legs? I don't uh, play with... Uh, him too much so I didn't even know what gear I had and didn't have excluding the the hooded ones like the new ones obviously those are like yeah that looks fucking cool I want that I think I had that already for him all right last two here any new black mantis stuff that I get will probably be traded in Vital point protector. What is this? Yeah. Meh. Yeah. Five pieces of epic gear. I like it. We got one more after this, and we are done. Oh, yeah, the ninja look, baby. This is still one of my favorite looks in the game. It just looks so amazing. Kryptonian skin. <clears throat> Some Raiden arms, of course. I'm gonna trade these in. Damn, actually, maybe not. I thought I had this already. Well, actually, I think I do. This is because it kind of confuses me because, um, like, the characters get shaded out, and I think, oh, look, there's some, like, um, you know, some like black tights on underneath the armor or something like that. But no, it's just he's uh, he's being shaded out. Wild night pads. I'm pretty sure I had that. All right, Captain Cold. I told you guys I don't have good luck when it comes to Captain Cold and headpieces. I got one headpiece, and it was uh, it was a headpiece that I already had, and then I get. Arms, legs, accessories, and fucking chest pieces. Come on, man. Give me at least one more headpiece for Captain Cold. He's like, he was one of the characters going into this that I was like, yeah, please, I, I want some Captain Cold gear. Um, but that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Zero, 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 and zero. Mother boxes left. I want to go check out this, this gear for Blue Beetle one more time because I think it looks amazing let's go check this out one more time and as you guys see um wait where is it i think it's this one no but i'll show you guys i already had like a bunch of different blue beetle helmets i just can't put them on like this one this is brand new i just can't put them on because of uh oh get that away from me see that this is the thing i don't like with blue beetle <laughs> it just looks ugly um, but here we go. Fuck, dude. Look at this beauty. God, it looks so amazing. And it looks like this I don't have. And that, I don't care if I have it or not. It looks like I do have it, but I was going to trade it in no matter what. Yeah, this looks, this looks ridiculous, man. This is definitely the best, uh, headpiece that I've gotten in a long time. Other than Batman, I think this might be the best new headpiece that I've gotten so far. It's just amazing damn all right guys so that is going to be the end of today's video thank you so much for watching i'm happy i did one more of these i don't think i'm going to do any more in the future 
um, because there's no new epic gear coming <laughs> and for the most part I have a lot of the new epic gear for a lot of characters that I do want to play but I'm happy I did one more because we managed to get some cool shit that I didn't have before and that I would have gotten over time because obviously I would have opened up the mother boxes but I'm happy I shared it with you guys so thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time what's going on it's super here and thank you for watching today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure you guys subscribe if you are not already also check out any of these videos linked at the top thank you for watching and i will see you guys next time